Alrighty, between uh, last time and and this time, I ran through this area briefly to basically kill all of the enemies. Because uh, I tried doing one of them on screen. Uh, they were very tedious. <laughs> this area basically just has... Wow, okay. Has like six fights that are all identical. That's all four soldiers and a helicopter. They take so long. Uh, but, on the flip side, they give quite a bit of experience. So I did um, reload a save a couple of times after killing them to make them respawn. So I get a couple more levels. So yeah, we're a little bit better prepared. Also learned some new skills and some new ethers. So, it's all good. Now, why can't I equip these? <laughs> uh, that's because of this, isn't it? No? Okay. Maybe you just can't. Yes. Cool. Uh, also, I figured out Momo's uh, transformation gimmick. I don't know when she learned it. Or... Whatever. Um, I can go into set. There. Uses star wind power to transform. And I'm still not entirely sure what it does. It kind of acts like her version of summoning the uh, gears, the mechs. In that it takes a turn, she changes form. But it doesn't seem all that different. It, she basically just turns into an adult form of herself. If you remember back to Xenogears, <laughs> for a uh, little reference, uh, I think her name was Emerald. I don't remember. But basically the girl who could transform, or eventually did transform into an adult version of herself. It's basically that. Uh, but the stats didn't seem that different. I don't know. Still need to experiment more with uh, that ability. But, yeah, uh, now I know what that um, other thing means, where it's uh, can only use while transformed. Yeah, can only be, can only be used while transformed. Now I know what that means, so... Mystery solved, I suppose. But yeah, that's basically what I was up to. I leveled up a few uh, techs as well, so... Uh, Junior can get off his um, AoE waltz ability pretty quickly now, so... It was, uh, it was some good, uh, good experience. They look kind of like Junior.
That doesn't seem normal. No. I've been asking that this entire game so far. <laughs> I've been asking that this entire game as well. <laughs> uh. So you're saying this really is Milsha? Yes. A world of unbroken memories slumber at the depths of your consciousness. Cosmos has sensed this and recreated it. This world, it is also Cosmos memory as well. Cosmos memory? No, that's not... Memories do not belong solely to one person and they are not fixed to just one location. No, I mean... It's... The original Cosmos was... That is a really cool effect. Destroyed during that incident two years ago. I love that filter. <laughs> Oh, it looks so good. Oh, damn! dear to you as well. Joyful memories form only one half of the whole. Only when they are combined together with the other half can your consciousness truly take form. You must. No. All of you must accept the entirety of your memories. Accept our memories? You must return to Milsha once again. Please tell me, why must I go to Milsha? Only Cosmos knows the answer to that question. Presumably you do too, otherwise you wouldn't be telling us. <laughs> she is waiting for you there. Cosmos is out there. Hey, wait up, Chief. Are you sure this is what you want? There is no turning back. I know, but they have some connection, don't they? She is vital to her. Nephilim and, and to you Chaos. Well? They seem to be on more friendly terms. On more familiar what terms. Do you do? Hmm. The mystery of Chaos grows ever deeper. Will we ever get answers? Who knows? Okay, so it's just us two now. Luckily, one thing I've also realised is um, when I was levelling up the other team, uh, it did also level up Shion and Chaos as well. So even if they're not in the active party, they are still gaining experience. So it's either damage two times bombs. Sets ether damage two times bombs <laughs> against BNG types. 
not entirely sure what that means, but it's fine. Well, let's explore this place then. Defense shields, nice. Swing. Uh, uh. Alright, there's nothing here. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Frame repair. Nice. That looks a little scary. It's locked. Thank something. <clears throat> See, I can't get down there just yet. I imagine that'll be a way back up, maybe, from inside. Who knows? This is a nice looking place, though. Look. I was not expecting that. Hmm. <clears throat> Blade Soul? the heck is that? Why does it sound so badass? Prevents conf- Okay, not as exciting as I thought it'd be. That's fine. <laughs> but three biospheres. Love to see that. Because I did use up quite a few of those in my uh, grinding session. Rejuvenate all. Whoa! That, that surprised me. Hmm. <sighs> Revive. Can't destroy this. No. Well, that was interesting. Bunny. Yeah, because this is a shopping centre, isn't it? I think I saw a sign for that outside. So I guess I guess it makes sense that there's like mascots lying around. Oh no! What? You. Bastard. You absolute bastard. <laughs> so that just negated all the damage I've done. We get it, you can heal. Enemies that heal is one of my annoyances in in, in games in general. It's, it's just frustrating. Just makes the battles last longer than it should. Jeez. you do anything else? <laughs> if we ever get into a fight with three of these guys, we are never getting out of that fight. We're going to be in there forever. Oh, it literally doesn't do anything else. It, it literally has no other moves. <sighs> get out of here. No, no peace for that guy. <laughs> He gave us a tech upgrade though, that's alright. Alrighty. Let's carry on. They're gonna be all over this place, aren't they? Oh. But I can't get over there. Oh my goodness! It did something else! Y 
Yo, that's a real good weapon for real. <laughs> Doesn't get used though since I got him. Yes, I feel like we do. If the cathedral ship is anything to go by, is basically one of the only dungeons in this game, I think, so far. Nah, there was the Pleroma as well. But there hasn't been that many dungeons in this. But, the cathedral ship was pretty big. So I'm guessing, this is going to be even bigger. And especially since there's a lot of these guys. It's probably going to take a minute. Even when they're not even damaged yet. They just heal themselves. Alright, moving on. That was a different sound. I don't like that sound. Hmm. What the hell? I won't let anyone die. Cobalt. I already know what that uh, basically is. It's kind of like a mythological humanoid sort of thing. Well, there's a lot of them. Hmm. Alright, slightly tedious fight. Luckily, the, oh, the, they're like the pixies in that they're hard to hit, but luckily, they do basically no damage to the mechs, so. Did pick up a kobold blade, kobold blade there, though, so. W whatever that is. Oh, bar to item, that makes sense. And for our troubles, PM card E. Do we know what that is? Is that, is that... Oh, promotional card for the card game. Still have not messed with that at all yet. I keep saying I'm going to. But knowing me, I'm going to get to the end of this game and never actually do it. <laughs> um. Hello. Really, how long is he going to make me wait? We said four o'clock in front of the park. Oh well, we haven't been on a date in a while, so I'm really looking forward to it. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to him. Looking forward. Qua. Oh. I won't let anyone die. Larva doll. That okay? No, no. Hmm. That that's not good. Hmm. <clears throat> You don't like to see that either. Do I have anything for that? Presumably that's a psych status. Alright, so what do we do here? Hmm. Let's hope we land the instant KO, I guess. I'll admit, I'm kind of not sure what to do here. Um, oh, you damage it with healing. Okay. Sure. Okay, sure that works. Well, that was interesting. No entirely sure what's going on there, but mission mission complete, I guess. 